Hey guys, it's Nick from Retro Games HQ, and today I am playing Kororo Beast. I'm going to jump into a battle first, and then I'm going to show you all more about it. But I thought, let's get into the interesting stuff. So apparently we're facing Mescalion, but here's his monsters. It's a monster taming game. Let's see, I'm going to pick him. Uh, you're going to see what these are in a second. You pick five out of your seven, and these are your, these are your reserves. I'm actually going to... Uh, I'm gonna put him here and we'll go with him. You'll see. Now, sadly, I did not bring up my top chart. That's fine. We'll be looking at the top chart later, although I kind of need it because I'm still learning the types. This is just a demo version of Kororo Types. This is uh, not the full release yet or anything like that. It's a monster taming game that uses NFTs. I know you all are like, oh my gosh, NFTs. But you know what? It's actually a pretty freaking cool game. So let's get into it. It's very nice. Everything's actually got two different games to it. But. Let's go into it. Okay, so he is dark and fire. He is light. I know he is weak against fire and spirit. He's weak against uh, water. He's water. He's water. See, he's attacking because he's water dark. He's armor not fire and earth and got 31 seconds left. This is me on the top left, but let's go. So he is going to be weak to that. But I want to make sure he's dead. I want to go ahead and just kill him off. Uh, you know what? No, I'm going to do this. All right. Bam. Ooh, Armanite hits hard. Hits. Oh, good lord. Is hit hard. I cannot speak. Okay, mm super effective as you can see. 31 from burnt, so he's burnt. Ugh. Yeah, you can only play this right now if you have a what's called a silver ticket and I'll include the link in the description below but it's on OpenSea and there's only two NFT games I have ever realized and of course my dogs are barking why you know something has to happen on the interstate while I'm doing this it can't just be anything normal um ooh, let me think about this real fast I think dark shade just because I think he's weak to it but I'm not completely sure let's see this is, raises the beast's the mystic defense by two stages. I don't think that matters right now. So I'm going to go for a magma shot. No, I'm going to go for a fire blaze. Okay, so there's multiple different types. I wish I would have brought my top chart. You all will see it later. Armanite's zero. He's dead. And, of course, the cooked chicken. Or, I guess, turkey. Not very effective. Okay, well, I was wrong. Light's good against dark. I've only played, like, six... Ooh, I really needed him. I really needed him. Oh my god. I really need the top chart, too. Ooh, man. Alright, Corvax. So let's get into this. Alright, so there's multiple types. And you can see the stats of your own people here and here. Uh, he's burnt. And then you can kind of see speed is actually a range. And the HP. I only have 46 seconds left, so I'll spend some time explaining. There's actually two games, one where you do some farming and stuff, interacting, MMORPG stuff, and then you got this. But everything is a NFT. I would recommend, if you are interested in it, to get into it soon before they stop doing it. Not stop doing it, but stop selling the silver tickets and the gold tickets, which are how you get into it at first. If you're an early adopter, you do have many advantages. But as time goes on, you might think, well, it's going to cost money. Don't worry. Over time, it's going to actually... I'm just going to do that. It's actually going to decrease. Um, 237. I need to do this. Acceleration. What acceleration is going to do is it's going to bring up my speed by two factors. Now, the way they do it is pretty much you get an origin beast if you get a silver ticket. And with that, what you're going to do is I wish my dogs would shut up. But then there's a scion beast that get made by them. So over time, the amount of monsters increase. And it gets it's going to get cheap. But this is the only, one of the only two NFT games I've ever thought about even supporting or anything like that because most are complete and utter crap. But Kororo Beast is a series team that they've not even released the game yet. They're still getting to it, but the games are almost completely complete just right out of the gate. It's actually pretty cool considering the state of the games today. Oh, man, I'm still not good at this stuff. shield shield is like protect but right now you see i'm actually at 474 speed the highest he can be is 380 the highest he can be is 253 and looky there well i just got a 
Discord message, of course, at the worst time. He's going to probably die. No, I'm going to have 0.53% left. If it doesn't round. So his defense is higher. Kind of a waste of a turn. Man, I'm really sucking. I think these two are starters. Cross of wave. Well, stuff just flickered, so let's hope that this recording doesn't stop on the way there. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, we'll do that. Ooh, fire spirit. Neutral. Just neutral damage. He's dead. Okay, Korvax dead. That's the right play, I think, because while he does hit harder, it's a matter of... Um, ooh, C2. It, it, it is a matter of speed matters. I, I, I'm going to do one more battle after this, but only after I explain Corona Beast to you all after I beat this guy. Fire, grass, I don't know. This dude's actually corrosive in combat. I think combat's only super effective against two different types, but he's water and dark, as you can see on the left. This is Dark Tide. Pretty cool tortoise-looking dude, or I guess turtle since it's water. Throw a tortoise in a pond, they'll drown. Throw a turtle in, they'll swim. Um... Hmm, doesn't really matter as long as I... Well, actually, he's going to hit me first, though, ain't he? Yeah, because I'm at 160. I put 50 points, which you all will figure out what that is later. Ooh. I think right now I just need a hit. I'm going to lose. <laughs> I'm going to lose, but... Uh, oh, well. Oh my gosh. Okay, that was the correct play. I, I at least say I got one down. It's freaking cooked turkey. Now he's dead. And he's hurt. That's why I like corroded and he got burned. Now I wonder if he could set corroded and burn. I've not tried that yet. Anyways, gotta go over here. Don't just sit here. Look here. Of course, your turn's 52. You have a bank of 100 seconds if you go over it, I believe. Now this is Metalodon, which is Metal Earth. He is Light Plant. He is Electric Wind. Now, this may not mean much to you, but toppings matter 100%. I'm going to bring up the top chart for next battle, but like I said, it's going to be the same. Paralysis. Actually, I think Wind's good against Earth? Question mark? Oh, well, there's Thunder, so let's hope my power doesn't flicker off enough to screw me over. I think... Combat's good against metal. Or earth? I guess I'll find out. Gale? Oh yeah, look up here if you want to see what's happening. <gasps> I was correct. Oh my gosh. I was not correct, but it's neutral. It's not ineffective. Stat change? What stat did he change? Oh, dear. Put it nicely. What's good against dark? I don't remember what's good against dark. Oh my gosh. Um. Paralysis wave. I think sandstorm is good against fire. I think he just protected against it. Because there's a shield. No, there's not. Oh, my ground's apparently really good against Corrosive, I guess. Cook chicken stays on the field. Kind of. He died. <laughs> Alright, come on, man. He'll kill me. That's for sure. I guess he'll eventually move. But anyways, this dude is Drazil. There is a few monsters that don't have names yet, but they're going to have their names soon. They've already had their naming contests, given out the award, or going to be given out their awards. But make sure you follow Corolla Beast because they are doing multiple giveaways along uh, with it. And you might win a silver ticket or a gold ticket. Depends on what the... On, yeah, try again. Uh, it depends on the specific contest, what it is, your luck. Anyways, I'll be right back. For you all, it's going to be instant. For me... It's not. <laughs>
All right, this is one part of the journey. So welcome back. Crow or Beast, this is their site. Just go to crowrobeasts.com. But the first ever on-chain PvP RPG. So it is an MMORPG. It's got two different games, but uh, you know, let's turn on some music. There we go. Hopefully it loops. Here's one of them. So you farm. Put your beast to work, uh, work farming for materials in the various zones, crafting together items to create more powerful moves, preparing for PvP battle, and discovery of higher tier materials in the Season of Chaos. Breed. Build out a team of beasts with self-replicating origin beasts to produce scion beasts. And that's exactly what it is. They also have some star beasts that's going to be origin beasts, but they're a small percentage, and they'll never come about more of them, unlike other possible uh, origin beasts. Of course, for some reason, this loop is not exactly a good loop. I'm not understand why, but we'll try this again. I really like the designs of some of this, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through this kind of fast, and then I'm going to explain the uh, battle mechanics and the other actual part of the game. Because there's another... I told you, there's two games. So stick with me. It's going to be hopefully not that long of a thing. I've still got... Three and a half hours of practice for coding, but you know, and no big deal. I just want to get this out of the way. <laughs> but train, train your beast to master its unique attributes, level up its elemental materials, and evolve into completely new forms. Now, this is a bit irritating with the music, so yeah. So go on. Um, no, I've got some else. Hopefully, that isn't too loud. Actually, you know what. In my ears, it's loud. So you fight. So it's season chaos. So here's the elements. I'll pull up a list, um, not a list, but a top chart. But here's the elements. You have water, plant, fire, spirit, light, dark, wind, electric, corrosion, earth, metal, and combat. Twelve of them. Click elements for alpha. I don't know what that means. I'm not clicking on it because I've not clicked on it. Anyways, here's the trailer. Go freaking cool art. Go check out the trailer. Now you get the golden ticket. Or silver ticket. There's golden tickets and silver tickets. So right now we're here. So a tradable NFT for early adopters. So this golden ticket guarantees your entry into the game in two beasts, one scion, starter beast, doge, toad, or, or monkey, and a self-replicating origin beast with a higher chance of being rare. Also, it replicates and gives you scion beasts. And as time goes on, there's going to be more scion beasts so people can, you know, battle with them. And it's actually pretty cool also what they do with stats, so stick around. So this is kind of the roadmap, what they're going to be doing. Uh, there's two games, then prepare for battle. You have PvP, real money prizes. That's true because of the nft stuff and if you have a problem with nft you've probably already clicked off if you don't have a problem with nft and don't have this moral crusade against it congratulations you're a rational human being that's not freaking out about electricity expenditure but don't think about like you know major institutions that you know like the whole banking system how much electricity does that take up oh uh, you know let's not give thought to that um and unlock more discover more locations beach rewards and materials so then you got the season of awakening I, ne I haven't had the audio on, on for this site before, and I've looked through it multiple times. Anyways, there's a team. Apparently, that's the end. Some really cool uh, pixel art. So, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to go back and show you all the battle system. So, one second. And welcome back for a second time. So, let's go into the play game. Ah, there's the music. So, we can go to battle with team builder. We'll go to team builder. And I've already built two teams. But, you know what, I'm going to select this one. First try, this was my first one. So you have all these monsters, which, um, hold on. So this is Corvax. He's wind, steel, and you see, I'll point out something major right here. So right here you have your genetic values, which, just your genetic values, it's what your base stuff is going to be on. But then you also have your skill points. You have 100 skill points to a lot on any and all monsters. Uh, I guess Gororos is what I guess they're going to be called. Here's what your value comes out as, so you can just, you know, take away, add. As long as it's not more than 100, you can do that. So it's very customizable. You can go in many different directions. Right now they have a limited amount of moves, but of course this isn't even at release. This is a demo, and they're about to release it. But you have a lot of different things like shield, uh, which, and it tells you what it is. It's a natural power, which, uh, natural power, natural stuff is going to be just your attacking uh, defense. This is mystical uh, attack and defense, but, oh, let's go back down. Uh, so, no, just 100 power. That, let's keep going down. So, there's a few others, like bronze, beam, um, oh, and there's some more. Arcane knowledge just raises the beast's attack by one stage. Now, shield, pretty much just protect, is what it is. Acceleration raises your speed by two, things like that. And then here we got Dark Tide. Metalodon, which is metal. Who would have thought? Armanite. Cool looking dude. I think he recently got his name, like very recently. 
Baskelton, which is or Baskelin, which is my his uh, evolution before I actually like more. But I love it. It's spirit and water, and then you have Storm Stinger, which is pretty cool. Lightning Bug, pretty much, and then Drazil. And you know what? Let's go back to my teams. I'm going to do this to show you all. Create new team. All right. So here's the list. We'll go through it real fast. But these are the starters. And what's cool about the starters is that, see, Argos. But then you have Argos 2F, 3F. This is fire. But he can also, because he's a starter, he has two stages for water and two stages for grass and two stages for electric. Same with Koji, because he's a starter. Same with Torudo, because he's a starter. And uh, I think we actually saw him get some play. Now, uh, Hydric's not... But he's plant water. You have Mandor, which is a cool little dude. Krakos, letting you um, go through. I think there's 137 question mark monsters right now. Dark Fox, he looks silly with that bomb jaw. But Spindle, Light Spirit, Corvax, Wind, uh, Metal, and his final evolution. Uh, you all can go. Uh, actually, are these online besides this? Because you can only access this if you have a silver ticket. And if you get a silver ticket, then what you actually do is you get a, an origin beast, but you don't get a starter beast. Uh, you don't get a golden badge. And there's some other stuff, but you have a chance to get a starter beast, and you have a chance to get a golden badge, or a golden badge or something else. You'll have to read up on that. Separate from this, but Metal Turtle, he ain't got his name yet. Arbonaut just got his name. Uh, Antique. So we keep going. So here's Storm Stinger, our little lightning bug. Or I guess big lightning bug. You got Tusking. I actually like the second one uh, the best of Tusking. Soul Tan. Uh, well, I like that name. Drog. Mantra. Montara. Whoops. Inferus. So we just keep going. Uh, unofficial name. Metalodon. Whoops. Light Flickered. I don't like that. I just realized that Metalodon is not the full thing. So I accidentally did that. I'll have to go back through and, re and fix that. Malweave. Fighting Bird. Ain't got his name yet, but they... The uh, name contest is over. Shadow Vine. I know we're going to go through a little bit more. So there's Dark Tide. Let's see. We're almost at the bottom. So stick with me, Rakuma. There, this dude's my favorite. Bass Skeleton 2, my favorite. Uh, and there's also different rarities. It's not necessarily that the rarer they are, the better. And you might hear the dogs barking. You might hear lightning. There might be some extremely dark clouds that suddenly appeared about 10 minutes ago over my house. But you know what? We're going to keep going. Except for you all. Because right now... I'm going to fix my team. We're going to go to the air team. I mean, our game. It's not the end. Just hold on. All right, so I don't have a battle yet. In fact, I'm waiting. But here is the app chart. It's not completely correct. Uh, but pretty much, you want to see, okay, I'm using water. Go down here. You know, or I'm defending. Go across this way. Now, let me see if I've... Nope, not got it yet. So, example, force is actually plant. There's something else wrong, I forgot. But there's three that has zero, which is going to be electric on earth, earth on wind, and corrosion on metal. The thing is, it doesn't give me a notification sound. So, pretty much this is what the top chart is. I'll be referring back to it. But, uh, yeah, I'll see you all when I get into a battle. Oh, well, hold on. All right, we're back. So, I am speed. Yeah, last time I was messing up what I was saying. So I need some this. I need this. He's fast. I'm gonna bring him in. Ooh, I need a medal. I have two medals. Okay, I'll do that. All right, let's go. All right. Be ready to keep seeing the top chart flash back and forth, back and forth, because. I have to get used to this crap. What I do like is that it's inherently double battle. It's not single battles whatsoever. And I like the pixel art. It looks nice. Alright, so let's do this. Okay, so he is... Let's go look what a lot is weak to. So light is weak to fire, spirit, and corrosion. So I'm going to focus on him. What is dark weak to? What is dark weak to? Dark weak to force, light, and combat. Oh, did I just say... Oh, I know. Him. Moves. And he's also weak to this. 
Let's see if I can knock him out. So he's 252, 300, 252 at best, 342. So this Dark Fox is moving first. Unless... Ooh. Not good. Neutral. Only neutral. He'll be attacking next. Man, that Koji doesn't even freaking get a that one turn at all. <laughs> what a good first turn. Great. It just ended up being the right monsters, the right types. That's a cool sound. So corrosion. Let's look. What's corrosion? Week two corrosion. Week two dark earth and metal. Dark earth metal. Well, thank God for this. Dark Earth. Let's see. He's at 392 to 442. He's gonna move first. That's insane. And I'm only 252, and here I put 50 points, which is the max you can only put. You can't put 100 points into one single uh, stat. That'd be a little OP. Ooh, but, uh, oh yeah, go to the link in the description below if you want to get the NFT to play this game. Of course, it's right now not a thing. So they've not minted it. They've not burned, rather, the tickets and gave you stuff. So you still have a chance. I record this on a second. Okay, so he's pretty much going to be, um... I guess waiting, but let's look at what wind. What is wind week two? Wind is week two. Light, dark, and... Oh! He tacked me. So just look up to the top left. I, I was stupid and did a zero... One of the three matchups, I guess, that could do zero. Um, nice. Nice. Wow. New shield, because I think he's going to come after me. Now, what's wind week two? Wind, 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 wind. Let's look at wind. Light, dark, and electric. Light, dark, electric. No. Um, so what is dark week two? See, dark's week to plant, light, in combat. That's perfect. Of course, Drazil's combat. Okay, shield, good. He's shielding. Oh, man. 60%. Oh, my God. See, I guess they do percentage here because they don't want to, you to know their actual complete... Um... What is wind? When's a week to light, dark, electric, light, dark, electric? Okay. Corrosion's week to what again? Dark, earth, metal. But I guess corrosion resists metal? Or wind? No, it doesn't. So it's just regular. Fine. Roundhouse slam. Oh my gosh. That's pretty terrible. So let's look at what electric and earth right here fast. So electric is weak to light and earth. Then what is wind weak to again? Light, dark, electric. No, let's let's boost my stats right here. Son of a gun. That's fine. Ooh, paralyzed. That's fine. Because of this. I, he, I'm a, he's, um, so, Earth, Earth, electric is 0.5 that, but then Earth is regular, so. But wind 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 electric yes corrosion no resistance to it I think I opened up my freaking discord I can't tell I'm literally trying to click my crap as fast as I can even if I did so it's a Kororo arena where you get um, paired up I am doing surprisingly well. This is my best battle. All right, spirit, spirit. What is spirit weak to? Water, dark, and metal. Dark metal. 
fire. Water, earth. And it's dark as well, right? So it's dark week two. It's forced light combat. So I'll be hitting him. He's water, so I'll just hit him. And it's combat, so I'll hit him. He's got low HP. Just inherently. Even if you boost it with... <sighs> Dang it. Even if you boost it, it's still not good. Mm. Almost. Fire and earth. He's 267, 342. Oh. He'll move first, so he'll kill him. Let's see if I can kill him. Alright. Come on. Let's go. Huh? It's just... And if you want to see this type chart, uh, go to their... Well, if you want to see the type chart and you want to play... Then once you get a ticket and you get the roll in their Discord, then just search up type chart and you can find it. The oldest messages pretty much say, oh, type chart. That's where you can find the type chart. Just because someone posted the top chart. Even though it's incorrect in the labeling of one of them, but... Except plant, it's forced. That was crap. Anyways, I still have one left. He has zero left. So you can safely say I won, but that's how you win. Now, before you go, I am going to show you the second game of, well, Crow or Beasts. All right, let's get into it. This is the second game, which you can play, if I'm right. It, it just try it demo.cororobeasts.com so it's not much but we'll look at it because it's just a demo so someone's here I right, then let's walk around dude's got some chicken legs all right let's sprint let's shift ah would you like to craft some items perhaps some, uh, extract some essences i'd love to do some crafting today this feature will only be available when you're wasp matt what MetaMask wallet has been connected. See you at launch. So pretty much only available because it's NFTs when you, um, when the game launches. You might think, oh no, well, honestly, right now, if you want to get it, it's the lowest it's been in a, ever. It's just pretty much people that are super interested got it. Now it's just the people that, um, you know, it's like the super interested already got it pretty much. Well, I'm glad you heeded my call and finally headed here. We need as many brave individuals as we can to unravel the mysteries of these islands. We will begin the trainer initiation ceremony soon. There's a strange fella who has, uh, who was here before. The beast, sta beast sage, we call him. He's promised everyone who comes in the ferries an egg from a beast all their own. We know that you can train these beasts and do wonderful things with them. They are a key part to the island's ecosystem. You can also battle with them. Uh, the bigger they get, the more they enjoy it, so be careful with that. Anyway, do what you uh, want to ask me. Uh, do you want to ask me about anything? So, yeah. So, let's ask about farming. What's farming? Um, yeah, sure. Let's look at the system. So, what is this? All right. See, inactive. And then you have Baskelin, Baskelin and Corvax. Krakos. Fighting Mantis. Still got to get the name on that. Terudo, which is a, a starter. And Skolgin. Skolgin. I guess... Pigeon, Skulgeon, and Mole. I think that looks cool. Oh, I see on his chest. But look, see, Sin Farming, Beach, Forest, Volcano. Uh, up here, is there not a different one? Anyways, I guess you pick. Yeah, you pick which one. And then this one's active. So let's look, look what he's doing. So Hydrake is currently farming, recovering materials at the beach, and then at the forest. And then he's doing it for five days. And it's Metal Turtle, which I'll be cool with. There's, well, I guess there's two tortoises. I mean, turtles, good lord. Uh, so, Volcano, and that's what that is. It's a MMORPG. You'll be able to see other people on the screen. And, uh, let's see, here's the bank. Hello, hello, this is the bank. You can interact with your wallet. We're not open yet. Come back soon. All right, I'm going to show you a few more things. So, I'm getting Discord messages, of course. Like, no one's sending me any other time of the day, and then suddenly... I guess this is some hero. Doesn't prompt to say anything, but that's fine. This is very much a. I know they're they're making the demo better, but they're also about to release it. So hmm, another one. Odium would mention there would be many of you. Who's Odium? It's one thing I don't know. I've never understood. So this would just lead back to the tower. There's one more 
thing I want to show you all. And yeah, so go to OpenSea, rather in the description below, and you can get a NFT to start, uh, which is just a silver ticket, least expensive, or a gold ticket. Right now, silver tickets are actually low compared to what they were. Now, luckily, I got them kind of low, so actually very low. So this is where the battles will be held. If you want to see the full building, let's look over here. It's pretty sick. Oh, yeah, I forgot this dude. It's literally a rock. It's got a big rope around it. A chill runs down your spine. I'm certain these cracks weren't here last week. And this dude pretty much talks about, hey, the roads are closed. Why? What do you mean? Do you mean the chaos boulder over there? My task to guard it. Inform the sage of any changes that occur. I can't remember how long. Well, ever since you guys arrived in the outer world and started roaming around the, uh, the island, cracks have been forming on it. Can't be good, right? Anyway, Sage asked me to make sure no one leaves the village until we figure out what's exactly going on. I'll warn you, go back. Okay, so this is going to be, I guess, since it's the age of season of chaos, this is what it's going to be about. A uh, nice place. They are improving upon it. I know that. I know the game isn't holding them up. It's these NFT contracts that hold them up. And this team has secured funding for two years they've just hired i think two or four new developers uh on top of the like, already 14 16 man team or whatever and they've already got funding for two years thanks to the nft sell-offs so if you want to get in it right now's the time it's a cool little game uh now why would you do it well one it's a cool little game okay and it's only started no reason why you would do it is because it's actually a neat concept of having these origin beasts that then reproduce, and that's how you get your scion beasts. And the difference is that scion beasts don't replicate, but origin beasts do replicate. And if you want to get a starter, pretty much Kororo, you better do it right now by getting the golden ticket. There's never going to be any more made while other scion beasts are made, so they're going to become more rare over time. Um, the rarity does change, but it doesn't necessarily mean that something that's more rare is better. It's some awesome pixel art, and yeah, you can trade. You know, you can get in early while there's a low supply of Scion Beasts and your Origin Beasts can be making Scion Beasts and you can be building up your team, trading with people early on. You can be, technically you could actually sell this stuff because they are NFTs and people will be willing to buy it. So you can actually sell it while time is, uh, or while as an early adopter, you get in, you can sell them. I'm looking to actually play the game. Now, that's to say that one of my beasts is like, you know, a good chunk of money. It doesn't mean I'll be like, oh man, I only want to play the game. Like, hmm, I can get this and get another beast. Another beast that's, you know, uh, comparable but cheaper. <laughs> Anyways, that's all for this video. I thought I'd just show you all. Usually I don't do this stuff. I know some of y'all just like an NFT stuff, but it's a cool little game. And it's only the second NFT game that I've ever thought, man, that's not... You know, how do I put this? This is actually something legit. Chain Monsters is also legit. Chain Monsters uses less NFTs than this does. This is, NFTs are just the game, in, in, integral to the game. I've never seen an NFT game besides those two that didn't scream, get away. And I've been pretty much keeping my eye on this stuff pretty good. I'm watching it because I uh, I like NFTs. I like the idea of it. There's some promising stuff because if you all think that's just about images, you are dead wrong, and you probably should, you know, go look it up more. There's some like smart contracts, all that stuff. There's actually some more stuff to it than just wow, an image, which regular NFTs have value as well. But it's all about subjective use, and there's other stuff besides speculation that you can use NFTs for. It's very early in the market. So, you know, pretty cool game, all that stuff. That's all for this video. Make sure you go watch another video. Make sure you go like the video. Make sure you spread the video. Uh, my God, do anything you want to with it. Even copy it and upload it yourself. I'm not a, uh, a proponent of any intellectual property. So yeah, who cares? Anyways, I haven't done a video in a while. Don't know how to close this off besides just saying, well, that's the end of the video, guys. And retro on.